Welcome back to Outdoors with Morgans. We're in the truck, hitting the road. We just dropped daughter Eva off at of college. So Melissa and I are going to stop and get some late lunch, early dinner. I don't know what you call it, but we're both pretty hungry. And then we're going to fill up the uh, Super Duty. We'll do a little mileage test on the way to Boonville. But uh, we're not going to get up there until pretty late tonight. But like I said, we're going to get fueled up, get the truck fueled up, and hammer down. What do you think? I'm hungry. <laughs> All right, so we just had lunch at Eaton Park. I just punched in the address to the hotel we've got 376 miles to go Melissa all right we're gonna stop and get fuel in the super duty and this will be a good mileage test cuz uh, mostly highway driving obviously but we'll see how it does Here we are. all right so Melissa and I we just stopped at a Cabela's in New York State and uh, nice Cabela's they had kind of a watered-down gun department i guess you could Open say but i want to show you something i can't believe this but we are averaging according to this 23.3 miles per gallon and we are still 870 miles to empty i can't believe the mileage that we're getting and then i was thinking about it it has to be because it's been so flat coming across 90. Probably so. You know what I mean? It has to be yeah. that. But there's Levi. We're going to check in, see how things are at home. We'll report back in a bit. All right, so it's first thing in the morning, and uh, we got in late last night. We are in Lions Falls, New York, which I think is about 10 miles north of Boonville, where the show is. And uh, we're getting ready to head down there now. But before we do, i got to show you something pretty impressive. So we were on the interstate for, you know, 80% of the trip. Then the last 40 miles was on two-lane. But the truck is showing 23.1 miles per gallon. And we drove 373.6 miles yesterday. And it's still 646 miles to empty. Now, I think when we leave on Saturday and get back on the interstate, this number will kind of level off or even go up for a little bit. But I think we will be able to get over a 1,000 miles out of one tank of fuel. So Melissa and I, we just got our first break of the day. Uh, we've been meeting people all day long. It's been really nice. But we are at the Woodmiser booth, and this is the first I've walked outside the tent. But uh, that's basically my mill right there, but that's got a gasser on it, I can see. I've got the Yanmar diesel. Got an edger right here. 
all kind of stuff. But later on today, we're gonna walk around a bit, check some stuff out. So Melissa's been sitting here for hours. I've been on the go here. <laughs> That's not really how it went, but uh, I'm here with Chris from Wolf Ridge. How's the uh, show going, Chris? Going great. Is it? Yeah, between the little patches of rain here and there, but otherwise the weather's been nice and cool. Not 90 degrees out, so that's nice. That's really nice, yeah. actually. I'd rather have it this way than that stuff. Right, you can always put another sweatshirt on. Or... How far is it uh, for you to get up here? Uh, it's about 16 hours. I think it's close to a, close to a thousand miles. How many uh, machines did you bring? Uh, we had uh, like four machines on our trailer, and then we had a long haul come with uh, 11 more. Okay. So we had quite a quite a load. Selling some stuff today? Yeah. Yep. Sold it. Sold one of the splitters, a few bag stations. Uh, we took orders for a couple other things. So yeah, nice. Good. That's good. good. Yeah. What do you think, Melissa? You ready to keep moving? Yeah. I also like the uh, metal color. The gunmetal yeah. gray. Gunmetal gun gray. Likes them gun metal gray. Yeah. Well, that's what the conveyor is too, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. Yep. Although I like the red too. And then there's some yellow over there. <laughs> Steeler Nation. It's you know. The colors. Yeah. Black and gold. We should probably send one of every color. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, no, no. Yeah. No. Yeah, that gun, that gunmetal would make a cool looking uh, Jeep or something. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. 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 yeah so that our diesel box wedge machine here 25 horsepower and uh, 38 gallon pump it's five second cycle time with this big five inch cylinder on it. that's so, that's impressive wow. yep works really well i'm gonna have to trade up all right we're gonna see how this thing does Nice hoodie there. Thank you, buddy. Good to Where see are you, you guys. from? Near Vernon Center. Okay. How many times have you been to this show before? Twenty, anyway. Really? Twenty, really? anyways. Wow. Yeah. yeah Weather's talking. always unpredictable here, isn't it? It is. Some days it's so hot you can't it's my stand first it. Time. It's our first time. First time. Yeah. Awesome. Yeah. Well, we're going to continue on. We haven't seen much yet today, but yeah. And then we'll be here all and day my tomorrow. At the hotel, so I had to buy a hoodie. Uh -huh. <laughs> So. All right, well, thanks. Great to see you guys.
All right, so that was uh, day one of the Boonville show. We didn't get a lot on camera. Tomorrow, uh, we'll definitely get some more and talk to more people. But Melissa's sitting here in the truck. I see she has a little snacky snack. Truck's running, killing our mileage. 